Have you been told that it's not safe to do CrossFit in your 50s? Or maybe you're interested in getting into some form of exercise and you're in your 50s and you really want to try CrossFit, but you're not sure if it's a safe thing for you to do. Well, that's what we're going to talk about today because we've got some great news for you. CrossFit can be an excellent activity to do in your 50s and beyond. It can also be an a good activity to start in your 50s, you just need to be a little bit careful when you do. Now, here is the one main thing, actually, okay, two. I'm gonna give you the two main things that I see with CrossFitters or the reason why CrossFitters end up in my clinic. One is that they, they go to CrossFit too many times or they do repetitive activities that stress the same muscle on a regular basis. So the whole idea with CrossFit is that you are working super hard, right? You've got to give your body enough time to recover. And as we get older, that time that we need to recover increases, right? So what you wanna make sure is if you're doing like pull-ups and push-ups and things that are really using either your hands or your um, forearms, that you have a day off in between so that those small muscles can recover. So that's the idea, you've probably heard it at the gym of having arm day and leg day, right? Where you're emphasizing one versus the other. Now that's absolutely fine. It tends to be in CrossFit that the CrossFit is more of a full body activity though, right? So what you need to do is make sure that your body has enough time to recover, which, how do you know if your body has enough time to recover? when the soreness goes away. So if you go to CrossFit, you wake up the next morning and your arms, let's say, are sore, you know, particularly in your forearms, then at CrossFit the next day, you need to make sure you're focusing just more on legs. Give your arms a break until that soreness goes away and then you're safe to go back and do it. Of course, making sure that you're staying hydrated and you've got all your electrolytes obviously helps your muscles he heal quicker in between sessions. That's the first thing is make sure that you're not overusing the muscles because we don't want to have tear down, right? The whole reason why you're doing it is to increase your muscles, right? And get stronger. All right. So the second thing is you got to make sure you have a good coach. You want to make sure that you have someone who's going to be watching you, especially if you've never done CrossFit before, because form is everything. And that's true with any activity, but it's definitely one with something that's a higher intensity like CrossFit. So make sure you've got a good coach who's watching you, giving you some good cues, making sure you're keeping your back um, in a good position and you're not putting too much stress on it or anything like that. Luckily, in the Maple Valley area, we have some great CrossFit gyms, so there's some really good options around here. But if you're not in the Maple Valley area, make sure you check out your gyms because we wanna make sure that you're in a safe place where you're really well um, instructed and supported in reaching your CrossFit goals. But the quick answer is, is it safe to do CrossFit in your 50s? Absolutely. It can absolutely be a great activity to build muscle mass. Building muscle mass causes more pulling on the bones, which helps to prevent things like osteoporosis. Obviously, you're going to be working on things like balance and coordination, which is always good to work on as we get older because we know that those things tend to go. So yes, CrossFit is a great and has the ability to be a safe activity into your 50s. You just wanna keep some simple things in mind to make sure that you're not damaging your body. If you have more particular questions regarding CrossFit and if it's safe for you, I encourage you to give us a call for a free body chat. This will give us a chance to talk to you about what you're currently doing, what your goals are, and the best way to get you there. Our phone number is 425-658-4944. Have a great day, everyone.